yourself I love Kalihi vlogs it's been more than three weeks I believe since our last video and that's because I was very busy preparing for my daughter's uh, wedding the wedding uh, turned out very well very successful in uh, many angles it's because there were so many people that helped us along the way to make the wedding um, beautiful and successful it was very memorable um, as one of our friends said um, it was like also a great reunion amongst friends and family we have uh, family members that flew from New York from Texas from um, Las Vegas from California from North Carolina from Australia. They came from different places just for this wedding. From speaking of friends, um, you know, back in the day, um, once you get a hotel for your reception, the hotel staff pretty much do everything. But nowadays, it seemed to be not so. Um, as far as I remember, my reception back then was at Ilikai. And as far as I remember, all we did was to drop off the centerpieces and um, the favors and um, they did everything for us the setup and all but this time it's um, at the Moana Surf Rider um, we did a lot of the setup ourselves the staff just did the basic you know so without friends that helped I don't know how we would have done it they were there early in the morning to set up the reception area, uh, put all the decorations, put all the covers of the chairs and the ribbons, carry all these tools and uh, materials. And um, it was just a lot of work. Um, everybody just came, you know, to help. It's really a big community. And I think um, that's what made the wedding of my daughter a um, success. Um, you know, in our world nowadays where everybody seems to just be friends online, uh, social media, but um, lack um, touch or lack in a person to person friendship. Um, I am so grateful that we have those kind of friends that would still come over to our house. Um, in fact, you know, what's so funny is I was telling my friends, oh my gosh, my backyard um, is a jungle already. I need to prepare that because we're going to have guests coming over. And there was a day that um, they came to help us, help us clean our backyard, you know, I mean, um, at the, this day and age, you don't expect that from your friends. So that I've, we felt so touched, you know, and um, and these are friendship that I've had since I came to Hawaii um, 40 years ago. You know, these are things that you can't buy. I was telling them I can pay somebody to do the yard work and all that, but that's not with love. Because of that, we were all happy being there. We were happy to see our children um, get married. And um, part of the coming together also is that, um, like for example, um, in my wedding, one of my good friends um, did a hula dance. Um, this year, when my daughter got married, he's the MC. And um, another friend is, um, she was my maid of honor. This time, she also has her grown children. They performed in the wedding, both of her kids. And that's so nice, you know? It's like a new generation, and yet, we're still, and we're not even living in the same neighborhood, um, yet we still have that connection that when time comes that we need each other, um, we come. We come together and we make it happen. We make it happy. It fills our heart, really. Um, another thing um, I needed to mention is um, my friends that you, you have seen um, often in my vlogs have a have a big part as well um 
we put together a video for the couple being aunties. Um, we feel that um, we have something to say and share to the bride and groom um, coming from uh, married people who have been there for so long, who have gone through so many things. And um, we, as a well wishes for the bride and groom, um, the aunties um, uh, prepared a video for them. So the preparation meant they have to uh, prepare what they wanted to say, they have to go on camera. I was their um, script person and I was their video uh, person and for the aunties that were in other state, they just videotaped themselves and I put them together. So that was um, a nice touch to that wedding and a lot of our friends were saying that uh, the speeches of the parents uh, turned out very well. They were so touched and moved. Um, for my part, um, I could talk and talk, as you would know, uh, but I felt like I wanted to do something different. So that was something that they didn't expect. I prepared a video to express how I felt about her marriage, their marriage. Um, what else? Um, one of our guests said that um, it's different here in Hawaii. We have the Ohana way of doing things, and um, he said that um, it's so nice of you guys here in Hawaii. I could see and I could feel that family, and uh, we hope that because we are in Hawaii and we love being here, that we continue this um, family um, and friendship um, where in whatever occasion we may have. We can see the fruit of um, friendships that last like this. Um, that's what I'd like to share with you. And I hope that um, what I experienced um, will also be um, experienced. You will also experience something like that in your own way and in your own version. So um, that's all for today. And look out for our next um, vlog. Aloha. Today, we bid you farewell with great wishes and imploration that you serve the Lord well, guiding His people towards salvation. Because that's what it means when hearts unite for a calling.